welcome back to my channel my name's Luce if you're new so today I am doing this look for you guys it's a different look it's more of like a holiday glam look and yeah I hope you guys enjoy it and let's get started so the first thing I'm gonna go in with is the Maybelline master conceal by face studio camouflage and concealer this is in the shade medium deep and I'm gonna do my eyes first just in case I get fallout I'm just gonna put this all over my lids Okay, so I don't know actually what look I'm going for today, but I do want to do something very dramatic with a red lip today. So I'm going to be taking my Morphe 35C palette, and this is a really, really bright palette, and I'm going to be taking these browns right here. I'm probably going to be taking these two, and I'm just going to put those into my crease. And then with the empty brush, I'm going to be taking this, like, I'm going to go in with, like, this reddish color right here. And then I'm only taking a, a little bit of that because these colors are very pigmented. And then I'm just going to take a little bit of this gray and just a dab of black. And I'm going to put this on my outer V. And I'm going to make, like, a little bit of a halo effect. So I'm going to put that in the inner corner as well. The key to a look like this is blending because you don't want to make it look too harsh. So I'm just going to be blending for a while. Okay, so now that I have that as my like smokiness kind of, I'm going to take the concealer again. And I'm just going to put a little bit on the back of my hand. And with a flat shader brush, I'm going to make like sort of a, a cut crease. But I don't want to do it too harsh because I just don't. <laughs> I'm going to take a little flat brush that's very, very small, and I'm just going to dip it into here, and I'm going to make like a little dome shape on my lid. So just like that and then so it doesn't crease on me I'm gonna take a big flat shader brush and I'm going to be taking this light tannish color right here I'm just gonna pack that on my lid just so my concealer won't crease just like that and I'm gonna do the same to the other eye okay so there are my eyelids right now they're a little bit messy but that's okay so now I'm going to be taking a um, glitter which I'm using this one from Blitzy. This is a nail and body glitter. This is in silver lining, so it's a silver glitter. And what I'm going to do is, since I don't have any like Fix Plus or glitter glue, hopefully this works, I'm going to be taking a flat eyeshadow brush, and I'm going to be spraying it with like a setting spray, and hopefully that will help stick it on. So while I'm going to let that dry on my eyelids, I'm going to do my eyebrows, but of course I'm going to do them off camera. Okay, so now that I have my eyebrows done, I did them a little bit more bold, bold today, so I'm just going to take up a makeup wipe, clean under my eyes, and clean like around my eyebrows. For primer, I'm using the Benefit Professional. So I'm going in with um, the Garnier BB Cream in light medium. Now this is just a little bit too light but hopefully it won't look that bad and I'll fix it up with bronzer and stuff but I just wanted to put this a little bit everywhere yeah see it's too light for me at the moment but I'll fix it with bronzer now that I have pretty much all that blended in and I look pretty white I'm going to go in with the same concealer from Maybelline I'm going to just put that underneath my eyes Okay, so now that I look very, very, very oily, I'm just going to powder this all in with the Physician's Formula um, Magic Mosaic Multicolored Custom Face Powder. And I'm going to bake with my e.l.f. High Definition Powder in the shade Hints of Tints, and I'm just going to bake underneath my eyes a little bit. Now that that is baking, I'm going to be bronzing my face, and I'm going to be using this palette. This is um, by Style Essentials. I don't know where you could get this, 
but I got it a while ago and I haven't used it in a while so I'm just gonna be using this and this is just the contour palette and I'm going to be taking the lightest shade in this which is right here for my skin tone and I'm going to bronze so hopefully that brought my skin back to life for highlighter, I'm going to be using this new one that I got. This is the La Laca and Cole B Lighter. This is in Peacher Peacher's Daughter. And this is like a, like a, uh, what is it called? A cream? So I'm just going to use this very lightly right here. Okay, so I'm just going to remove this powder from underneath my eyes and I'm going to put a little bit of this highlighter underneath my brows okay to finish off the eyes I'm going to be taking the Kat Von D eyeliner and I'm not gonna do wing or I might do wing I don't know I suck at wing eyeliner I suck at eyeliner period so we'll just see where this takes me I just saw the biggest bug ever. My heart is like... Lord Jesus. Okay, so after having a little mini heart attack, I finished my eyeliner and I also used the Lancome mascara because I wanted to try out a new mascara today, but I just cannot leave this mascara. So I'm pretty much done with my eyes. And the last thing I have to do is my lips. So I have two options for lips. Now you could do whatever you want. So I was gonna go with a nude first, but then I saw that I found this red lipstick and I really want to do red so but anyways for the nude side if you just want to do nude I have the Kylie um, matte liquid lipstick and lip liner this one's in the shade Dulce K so so I have this but I'm gonna go in with red and I'm gonna go in with the lip liner this is the NK lip liner of course because this is the only red lip liner I have Okay, so now that I got that on, I'm going to go in with the NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick. And this is in the shade Kitten Heels. And it's just like a big old bright red. And I'm just going to do that on my lips. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and yeah, I really do like this look. I do want to do more different looks than just natural looks. So if you guys have any requests that you guys want to see, leave them in the comments down below. Don't forget to follow me on all my social medias and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.